right. and that's where it dangles. Well, yeah, because he's supposed to have a huge dick. So, like, he picks it up, and it's like a rod. It's it, not really a wand. Right. It, and he had a little bat sidekick. Right, I remember that. In real life. I don't know about that, but okay. Yeah, why don't you go ahead and tell the people what you just told me off mic. I got a life shroom? Yeah. Monks is out here peddling in shrooms. Yeah, dog. Real deplorable. Uh... Can't believe we're talking about hard drugs within the first 30 seconds of this episode. I, we're going to have to scrap it. We're going to have to demonetize We're going to have to delete it. We're going to have to get rid of it. Yeah. <laughs> I've never done shrooms before. Really? So yeah. uh, I've only done them. I've, I've only done shrooms once. And uh, it was so Kyle, the other guy, uh, the other person on our ch channel that comes by from time to time. <clears> um <throat> Our birthdays are relatively close. I'm the beginning of January. He's the end of November. Right. So for our quote-unquote Sweet 16, we had a combined per birthday in December. Right. Where we rented out like a local rec center and did... This was back in the day where we all all used to go to local concerts and shows oh, all the time. I, I and had a bunch so of much. friends that were in bands. So we essentially hosted a, a, a local concert as like a combined birthday party. And... Someone came and gifted us a bag of shrooms for right. our birthday. So after, once everything started winding down and we had people come back to the house for the night, Kyle and I split them up. Oh, God, that's going to crap on me. I apologize. <laughs> and uh, tripped balls the rest of the night. And I'm sorry for saying this, but... I, was, I, I ate them right in front of my mom, and she didn't even realize. I, they were, I had a chicken patty right. sandwich, and I had them in there, and I was just munching on them while I was talking to her. I'm sorry, Mom. I was a, <laughs> I was a chi I was a ignorant boy. <gasps> no. Why are these guys green? Because they're hyper-paragumas. My God. I don't want to live in this world. I don't want to live in there a world with hyper-flying I'm, I'm, I'm getting the jump down now. So do, do all of your paper companions just exist folded up in your pocket? I mean, I, I guess that's be the logic for it, yeah. What a horrible existence. That's <clears> a <throat> dirty ghost. It is. Why he's so brown? Because <laughs> this is... Further as a dirt ghost. I'm not, I'm not gonna say what I was gonna say. What, you, were you gonna say some evil? No, I think you were gonna say something evil and racist. I think this is further further south. Come on, monks. It's 2024. I know. What are you doing? I know because there's ghosts in Tub Above His Castle that are I have to fight, and they're also the same color. What? Are the, what? Wait. What kind of ghosts serve that guy? I don't know. What a bunch of idiots. Right? If they're ever... Look up sheeple in the dictionary. You'll see a picture of those stupid ghosts. Yep. Oh, yeah, here, watch, watch. I had to, I had to go invisible. Oh my God. Let's just pull that patch off his chest and watch him deflate. <laughs> Funny you say that. Is that what actually happens? No, but like... I, I can't well, there's, there's, there's a reason why the patch is there. See, the dude was gonna sell us out, and he got eight anyway. Mm -hmm. I don't think he was selling. I don't think he was selling us out. Oh. I don't think I'm. I'm skipping through the dialogue because I don't know what <laughs> he said. I know, but you recently played the game, so I thought you knew. Like a year ago, I thought you. I did it more recently. No, it than was that. about I'm a year sorry. ago because I remember I was beating. I was finishing the game when uh, Sean was in town. Gotcha. And that was at least a year ago. <gasps> the badge. Nice. Get rid of that dusty hammer. Get rid of that dusty old hammer. Can we do one damage? We don't need it. The Goomba's sick. He's filled with rot. Yes. He's got the Goomba rot. Knock this little boy onto the ground. Bam! Bam! And now... Terminate with extreme prejudice. Yes. You remember Broforce? Dude, I loved Broforce. That was a fun little yeah. indie game. Yeah, it was. 
The, I think that I, I believe that studios made a handful of really fun like co-op games like that. Yeah. Just kind of retro platformer shooter type yeah. games. Shit. They may have made that. Um. What was that? Holy game fuck! He, holy ass! He did eight damage. Yeah, because he up 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 the damage uh, by six, I believe. Uh, but I, I think they made that game we played. Uh, Kyle and I played a long time ago called Extreme Exorcism. Yeah. I think that may have been the same company. Ah. Uh, it's also a very fun game. Belgium. Rub it on your pits. I'm invulnerable for a short time. Nice. Good. Very good. Uh, not not as it. good. Nice. Yes. Is there any way to hit all of them in the air at once? I mean, this. Okay. Is that freezing? Um, it might make them drop to the ground, which would be good because I have a fucking grounded uh, yes. uh, ally right now. Bam, Bam, baby. It doesn't drop them. This fucking sucks. That's dumb. Yeah. Uh, get her back out of here. That snowman was literally stomping on them. Why didn't they drop? Yes. Ha ha ha! Three for three. If I went out and stomped on a bird. Oh, here we go again. He's, this guy's dead. Ten damage, motherfucker. Bet you if I timed it right and stomped down just as a bird was flying by, he'd fall to the ground. I'm sure he would. Damn, she's got some nice... Yeah. She's got hands, dude. She, she does. Oh, you're not going to get away with this. Oh, <laughs> You're not going to get away with this? Nice, dude. Oh, nope. Oh, oh hey. yep, yep. It's so annoying because oh. it's a freaking like. It's using the other stick to do the buttons because it's on a C stick, or it's supposed to be on, on the C buttons and stuff. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Monks, I think we're you're, I think we're gonna about to level up again. Shit. If you stop fucking around. Bam! Damn. I thought... So they must have eight hit points? Seven Good hit chance. points? Ouch. If we had that little snitch out, we'd know. Yeah, but... You know, in my opinion, seeing the health bar is not... That great, yeah. ...helpful. I agree. It's... It's a psychological... Uh, right. It's like a psychological improvement, I guess? Or psychological... Uh, buff, right? I guess you could say. Besides, because like, it's like, oh, I'm almost there, almost there. Like gives you something, right. give you that extra push. I think later on there is a badge that lets you see the enemy's health. I, I believe you are correct. Because I never, that I never used exactly got what I needed. Bro. Exactly got what because I needed. Because that reason, got some BP. Let's see, power jump is one that you always need because that's a great one. Oh, kidding! Yeah, this is a great one to have. When Let's already destroy a weaker enemy with a first strike. That is that is pretty good. I don't think we have any more spiked enemies right now. All right. Um, HP up. That's gonna be good one to have. Uh huh. We got one available. For, mm -hmm. We can do first attack or a re refund, which helps g give me more coins. So, yeah. All right. Yeah, so HP is always a good one to have. So now I have 25 instead of 20. Bro, there was a coin behind that. Oh, you just said there was no more spiked enemies. Look what we got but, here. But no, but no, Tim. No, 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 no. Watch. Gonna make him quake. I'm gonna make him quake. Oh, Ouch. nope. They, they, motherfuckers didn't. Because in, in, uh. That's embarrassing. Oh, yes. That's embarrassing. Nope. This is gonna hurt. He must be executed. Dude, you're about to get a double dump. Oh, shit. Shit. Oh, bro. You didn't yeah. block either of them. I know. Nail, 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 nail this son of a bitch. You can be my wingman any day. What's behind that rock? There's something there. <gasps> it's another Chaos Emerald. Yes. That, that'll be eight. Yes. How many do you need? 
Those are just things you can also trade with. Ah, a currency. Other things, yeah. A premium currency, if you will. Yes. Why don't you go trade it to Sonic for some chili dogs? <laughs> just kidding, Nintendo didn't own Sega yet. <laughs> they didn't. The Dreamcast was... Still think with Dream, yeah, Dude, the Dreamcast... I, I really need to get... I think I... I might actually have all the cables, but I need to get some more games for mine so we can start recording oh, some gosh. Dreamcast games, dude. Straight from the OG console itself. It's the Dream. <gasps> Cast. Yes. I didn't even mean to do that joke. We could play Seaman. Play Seaman. Yes, Tim. I understand the joke play crazy taxi I, we could play crazy taxi and ps2 also technically but it would just it'll it'd mean more if we played it on the game or the uh dreamcast you know what i mean I, I do the sonic adventure games on the original hardware yep Ooh. even though that's probably <laughs> that's he's you know, the thing is, people are like, oh, it's so Gucci I, as fuck. I, I, I'll tell you, I never had an issue with my copies. Same. The, on, the only I same issue I had with my Sonic Adventure 2 was that the music would always be louder than yes. the dialogue. But other than that, like, mechanically, Kinda I like never how had this, How the outside is being very really loud right now, too. There's some chaos going on. I live in a dangerous place. Aha, here's something good. With this, you can... Which party member do you want to upgrade? Oh, okay, so this is what you yes. need to upgrade party member. And later on, you get a, a Ultra Stone. Then every time you go to a uh, upgrade thing after that, you can upgrade them a second time. Oh! She is super rank. Bro, I'm super ranked. There we go. Smack the shell you. Get this bluth lipped beast out of here. <laughs> blue lips. <laughs> that's that's my yeah. new term for any time I see a, because we talk about it all the time. Yes, we, we do. We talk about Don Bluth and his big lip beast characters all the time. So anytime they pop up, I'm like, that's a that's a Bluth lipped beast. Twink and twinks and bears. Bluth. As that's his best. <laughs> Bluth. That's not true. He can draw some sexy vixens as well. True. Just look at Princess Daphne. Woo. Yikes! Find the key! Yowza! Anastasia? Whoa! Speaking of Anastasia, so obviously Rasputin is based off the real Rasputin, Rasputin right. who is like a dark magician, so called dark magician. Um, sex magic was a big thing yes. with the real Rasputin, yes. which is why, if you notice in the movie, his, uh, his, uh, magical implement is a very phallic looking, it's not even really a wand, it's literally. Almost like a dick-looking yeah, tiny it's, scepter. It's, it's been a very long time since it's, it's, it's on a necklace and it hangs. And that's the other thing. Yeah, it, he's supposed to have a huge dick. Well, no, no, no. It's on a necklace, but it doesn't hang around his chest. The necklace goes down to his crotch, right. and that's where it dangles. Oh well, yeah, because he's supposed to have a huge dick. So like he picks it up, and it's like a rod. It's it, not really a wand. Right. It, 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 so it, it's supposed. It's supposed to be a kind <clears throat> of subtle nod to the actual history of him being a sex magic, right? Evil wizard. And he had a little bat sidekick. Right, I remember that. In real life. I don't remember that, but okay. 